All right, here we go. Andre Feely against Calvin Qatar. Calvin, the late replacement, touchy Feely, has not competed since late last year. Proud member of Team Alpha Male. Kicking things off here at the UFC 214 face-offs. Close to Anaheim, California, Saturday night at the Honda Center. There you go, Feely, Qatar, that is this Saturday. Moving along now, there you see T-City himself, Brian Ortega, who fights not too far from here against Renato Moicano. Ortega, the master of the triangle choke, still undefeated, has also not fought in quite some time, getting over a shoulder injury. Great to see him back, and he is representing the West Coast. Moving along, we say hello now to Aljamain Sterling and Hennon Burrell. This fight taking place at 140 pounds. It was supposed to be at 135. The California State Athletic Commission said, no way, 140, given Hennon Burrell's past weight troubles. And it seems right now as though they are jawing back and forth. Some words being shared by the New York fighter and the Brazilian fighter. A very interesting fight, and they continue to talk. They continue to go back and forth. That is one to watch on Saturday. Aljamain Sterling and Hennon Burrell, the former bantamweight champion. Now we move along. Jason Knight, Mississippi Mean, getting up in the grill. Uh, Ricardo Lamas, face-to-face, toe-to-toe, nose-to-nose. Important fight at 145. It was supposed to be Ricardo Lamas versus the Korean Zombie, and now they're going back and forth some more. A lot of bad blood here this afternoon in Anaheim. Jason Knight and Ricardo Lamas going toe to toe. Squaring off to the assembled media. Jason the Kid Knight, what a year he has had. And now they actually shake hands, so that is nice to see. <laughs> Ricardo Lamas and Jason Knight. We move along now to Jimmy Manua and Volkan Ozdemir. An important fight in the 205 pound division. Will the number one contender emerge from this fight? Some talking back there. Jimmy Manua, Volkan Ozdemir. What a year it has been for Volkan Ozdemir. 2 0 in the UFC, knocking out Misha Serkinov in a matter of seconds. And he is looking to cement his place atop the 205 pound rankings. Jimmy Manua has been on a roll as well. London's own poster boy, Jimmy Manua. What a great fight that is in the light heavyweight division. And now here we go. Robbie Lawler, Donald Cerrone, a fight that is a little less than a year in the making. Robbie Lawler we have not seen in almost exactly 365 days has his usual unimpressed look on his face. Seems like he'd rather be anywhere else but here, but that is why we love Robbie Lawler. Fun fight there, Robbie Lawler and Donald Cerrone, and of course three title fights this Saturday. It's UFC 214, live on pay-per-view.